Hello, it's Jason Payne for Cool Banker Dean Harp Realtors. Now today I'm just south of Blanco, Texas. A little bit further north than I usually do, but uh, I have a client who's looking at a builder that's got some example homes in the community of Rock and Jay Ranch, south of Blanco. This is built by Everview Homes. So I'm kind of doing this to kind of showcase this home and this neighborhood, uh, neighborhood to see if this is a good fit for him or not. All right, let's go check this house out. All right, if you saw my videos before, I have covered Everview Homes. They normally do uh, a lot of like a little bit larger custom homes or semi-custom homes. They also can do like a build on your own lot program where if you've got a lot, they can build a house on it. This is more of a production level home. The house is 2,300 square feet. They say three bedroom, two bath. But this community is kind of a golf course community, very quiet. Uh, this house is on 0.29 acres, so almost a third of an acre. But uh, I just wanted to showcase off what they could do and see if one of my clients uh, wants to use them as a builder and possibly consider this neighborhood. All right, let's go on inside and check out this house. This house is currently on the market uh, as of 1 March 2024. Seller's asking $395 for it but just some really neat little details that they have in this house. All right, come on in. And of course, almost forgot, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe to my channel, uh, because that does help. Um, this home right when you come in, it's a little bit different than your standard production home. It's got a lot more neat features. Uh, Everview does not do like the mass build. Um, they can really do whatever they uh, set their mind to. But coming right inside, you got your office up front. Could be a bedroom, because it does have a closet. But uh, nice windows, nice little use of space. Little closet right there, kind of a gaming type closet. Not really a hanging up closet. I don't see any hanging stuff. But perfect if you wanted to use this as your office. All right, come around. Love the little details that they've put into this house. This is going to be your full bathroom. It's a single story home. But yeah, plenty of space in this bathroom. You got your shower, mud inset, I mean they cut into the concrete to do that. Got a little bench to sit on. And we got two bedrooms tucked away on this side. These bedrooms are like 11 by 13 or 10 by 13. Your old closet space there. Eight foot doors in this house. Here's the other one. This is gonna be a little bit larger of a bedroom. Really nicely done window. And the closet. Got your shoe rack and hang ups on one side and tall hangups on the other side. All right, let's head into the kitchen because it's a pretty nice little kitchen. Um, this community is on septic and it is a gas community. So that's why you got the gas cooktop. Like I said, this house is on the market right now. So all this stuff is brand new. So we got brand new GE appliances, profile, profile series microwave, really nice size pantry. And then you've got kind of the, the nice island, little small little middle section, your granite. It does have the 50-50 sink. So uh, you guys know my feelings on that. But lots of good living space. And I want to point out, like I said, beautifully done flooring. But check out the details they put into this roof. It's just really nice upgrade from what you normally see in a standard production home. This is the main living space. Checking out the roof. A lot of can lights. Just really an intentionally done design. Plenty of space in uh, the main living room spot. you got a little plug for your couch. And back up so you can really see this use of space here. 
So lots of space that you can do anything you want to do. Uh, this is a golf course community. Um, talking to the builder, it's like, yeah, there's quite a few lots still available to be purchased that do back up to a golf course. Now, you don't necessarily need to be a golfer to enjoy living out here. Uh, <clears throat> the big benefit is nobody behind you, wide open spaces, and you can see what this guy did with his lawn. He went real low maintenance back there, but uh, just a beautiful lawn. You can see just the Texas Hill Country. And the Blanco's a really nice, quench essential Texas small town. It's got a beautiful courthouse in it. And if you are in the Blank in Blanco area, make sure you stop off at the Esperanza. <laughs> hey guys, it's been a long day. Esperanza Winery and talk to my good friend Raven. Uh, she's awesome. Well, Miss Raven, sorry. Miss Judith Raven. I've been on my motorcycle for a while today, so talk to Judith, and she's awesome there at Esperanza Winery. All right, once again, looking at this ceiling. Wow, they just did a really no a lot of fancy dancy stuff in the ceiling, in the master bedroom. Love the use of space in here, this little eyelid knocked out right there. That's really nice with lots of windows looking out over the golf course. All right, let's head into the master bedroom bath. Do have two vanities. And a really big walk-in shower. I love these because you don't have to worry about shower curtains at all. Kept kind of the same colors as in the kitchen. And a really big soaking tub. Might want to put some blinds up there somewhere down the road, but that's a gorgeous tub. And your water closet right there. Checking out, speaking of closets, let's check this one out. Oh, they even have a big off season rack there so you can put your coats. It's beginning of March right now, so that's really kicking in springtime in Texas. It's a beautiful 72 degrees outside right now. And uh, that's why I took the bike up here. And plenty of storage racks in this uh, garage setup. And I guess you could do whatever you want to with that little bench there going across. All right, let's give one last look of this area. Love the little nooks in there so you can get a little creative of what you want to put in. All right, that's going to do it for a tour of this Everview Homes built just south of Blanco, Texas. Remember, this is 2,300 square feet, three bedroom, and they're asking, I believe, 594 for the house. If you got any questions on either this house or the builder itself, I'm not, this is not my listing, but I can represent anybody wanting to purchase this house. I'd be happy to help them. Or I can get you more information about the builder if you're curious about the, if you've got a lot somewhere you want them to build on, they can definitely do that. All right, if you like this video, hit this like button, subscribe to my channel, and of course, share these videos with your friends and family. Sorry I'm studying my words today. Uh, I'm a guy, we only have so many words we can get out one day before we just kind of start shutting down. And I've talked a lot today. All right, talk to you later. Take care now. <laughs> Bye.